Ndar Len ku nek ci turam ak santam right now ñu ngi live and direct fi nga xamne mom moy National Assembly bi ci Banjul na ra féké li nga xamne nak mom moy Jawara luñ ko nara cieural state bi ci buñ ko nara jox gannaaw bi nga xamne geena na aduna parke limba on wednesday on tuesday ñu ko ñaanal suuf seeda ci kawam ba tayit rek di leen wax ne gam yental na tv ay deke ben nekal leen fi ci state house bi ci banjul anda seek fatou samba ak aissatou diallo way bala may wax dara rek ci ki nga xamne mom moy sadaw da jawara dina bay rek ñewit ñu nuyuwante ak askan bi fatou samba wa jerejef aida aida tay ne kana bes bo xamne besi gambien ñep la kep ko xamne gambien nga kep ko xamne non gambien nga kep ko xamne lu muna doon in gambia fi la war nga xamne ne sa dawda kayra ba jawara moy won the first president in gambia aida jamono ji ñu fi gis kep ko xamne borom namba tankay rawati na nak ñi nga xamne ñoo nekkon ci forma government bi rawati na nak ñi nga xamne nak ñom ñoo nekka li nga xamne moy politician yu magi ñom MC Cham gis nañ len fi ko min ni bibi dabo gis nañ ko fi gis nañ fi politician yu bare 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 political party bo xalaat tay mu ngi fi ko min ni Aliyam Seka UDP gis nañ ko fi action party tamit gis nañ fi ki mu ni Moussa bacheli gis nañ ko fi gis nañ kilifa dini kilifa ada yi gis nañ ku melni ki nga xamne nak moy imam bi gis nañ fi tamit imam yu bari 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 gis nañ fi tamit ñi nga xamne nak ñoy ambassador ci gis nañ fi tamit ñi nga xamne ñoy minister ci manam de koren minister yi gambia yi gis nañ fi tamit ku melni first lady bi mohamed mingi ni mo diko seen mo ngi tok ci bor yi ñi nga xamne nak ñoy minister yi jamono ji ku melni honorable amad bah gis nañ ko fi ku melni honorable badara djouf gis nañ ko fi gis nañ tamit forma vice president ni gambia mom tamit gis nañ ko fi fatoumata diallo tamba jang obi konate gis nañ ko fi mom tamit nekkon kilifa bu maga maga mak ci dekk bi ku melni minister bi di honorable usman sila bi mp mom tam gis nañ ko fi minister bi di ibrahim sila mu amé walum information mom it gis nañ ko fi ay da tay dal place bi yandjana place bi rina ci biti tamit ñu fa gis nit yaang fa fess del di len won li nga xamne nak mo fi xew comme numa lañ ko waxe gambien talents nak di len in the full coverage of li nga xamne nak mo fi xew way la tamay dem rek ñu bayyi ay satu jallo mohammed mi ñuy wante sun mbokki al pulari su ko defé rek ñu ñew ini len brief history kan moy sa dawda kayra ba jawara ok fatou jarama assalamu alaikum musibbe an fobe musibbe an jobe meden salmina on kala ka wonire inde mo yettore mo am hande non gino men do banjo kan sonal assemblée no andir do non hande gambia fop e biddo gambia jo kala ka wonire hande no hebi sohla mawnu do ko woni on sohla ko olando ati do lama de gambia ko o woni ko fati hecci hanki etalata ko hande non o wona jonnite de joma men den do no mo inna alla yo Allah fiyonu e ya fomo Allah kaw fokito to yo bura mo kaw ini ga mo inne no nga mo bura e andere den den inde tende sa dawda jawara la ni do dubi hewu de ko do woni gambia ga ko on don no mo tawa e piru ben fiyo gambia hetu hore mum e judo be yimbe dane be ko do woni porto ben no yiir don do no mo hewi mo ya wonbe ben non ka ya sene buri wonbe ben kan der ga o yi ga wa forma vice president on don ko ay satu tam bajan first lady on kadino ga fatuma tababaro minister be hewu be ko tawa ila elamu makko haya ye kalamu de dabo ha hewti lamu jodi ngumon nene the civil servant be ko woni ri kon gambia fop hande fop mo dari do no tawa e o sohla mo bibbe gambia be be ngibe de mo gambia be be kala yido do gambia jo hebe ha jonno men halu yana on ko humbe woni on sada da jawara kono adime wadde dum mi jonni tay be mi wonde ben ko do ni aida kebe ñu ñu ko xamuton ñu mun fi jangé ñene 
ñu ko xam tamit ñu mëng ko dekat lu do amna ci solo torop sa daw da nekkon ko xamne ni doomi gambi yan la te gambi ya fi la judo mu judo nak ci dekk bu ñu wax barajali nekk sama katti island division mum nak fuf la judo sa daw da nak judo ci ñaari way jur ki ngi na xamé ci mama fati mum nekkon ni yaayam ak ki ngi na xamé ci al mame jawara mom nak mu nekkon wa juram bu gour tay to ko xolé aïssa do sa daw da mu ngi judu on the 16th of may 1924 mom nak bes bobu nonu la judu dundana nak yalla may nako at yu beure beure waye it ñu ngi doon ñaan nak yalla gënon ko yok waye it aduna ni la demal ma ngi ñew 1924 la judu ba 9 ba 2019 la gëna aduna waye soko xolé mom nekk doomi gambia judo fini ci gambia gi defna lu bëri contribute na a lot towards the development of the gambia pour gambia mëna mom bopam fulam ñi nga xamanteni ñom ñoy ñu jëlon fini duñu rôle duñu def lu leen neex mom nak bokk na suñu nga xamanteni ni xex neen ba dagalul nonu fi ci bir rew mi waye aissatu bala ma dem ci educational background am bi dina la baye rek nga waxtaan nak suñu mbokk alpulare si kan moy won sa daw da kera ba jawara jarama aida ha joni mi den andintina on mi den ka fatunde sa daw da jawara no yiirdo non ko do ni sonnabe makko be ngewti be kengo be jodi be da wadbe daneje ko ben don woni sonnabe makko be fami on fop ko yari ka bi be ko yari ka tani rabe ko yari ka jati rabe be fop no do ko no fomu me yeton ko boni sa daw da jawara sa daw da no jibina tonka inete barajeli dum ka makati island o jibina no mawbe makko no andi almami jawara e mama fati ko hitande honde o jibina himo jibina system me 1924 o fawoni non ko o jettita ma ko acci en ka aduna do e nde hitande inetende august 2019 alla o kimu non dubi o wuri dubi chapande jenay e jowi ha jono me yetto on ko honto o jangere e ko hondum o wadi bay gambia sa hewti hay bobo jibina do sa lande kemo o yetto ma ko boni sa dawda jawara wara ko ndu wadi sabu dum ko sabu golle makko e darande ndew darani den gambia o darani gambia be ben fop ha nu o jettitirani ko no ha joni mi watta hay fu mi joni tay dim mo be am ben be yewta seeda a yiltito de me yeto ko honto o jangi ko honno honno o rewrede ha o hewti ka wondo waaw aissatu lolu amna solo torop tayit so ñewé wax ci education e ki nga xamné mom mo nekk sa daw da jawara nekk na gambian bo xamanté né gambian bo am xam xam la gambian bu jangon la soko xolé jarna ci school li bari wayit emut ci gambia bi rek gëna na gambia bi dem yeneen dika ci rewu touba bi dem yokal li nga xamné mom moy janga wayit so démé ci Uh, educational background of ki nga xamne mom mo fi nekkon jitté rew di sa daw da kéré ba jawara uh, mom nak uh, jarna fi nga xamne mom moy mohammedan school uh, mohammedan school nak mu fa joggé uh, dafa win li nga xamne ni mom moy scholarship uh, ba dem uh, fi nga xamne ni mom moy uh, methodis Methodist Boys High School demon na fuf nak tay bu mu fa demé di nga gis na nekkon student bo xamanteni ni when it comes to science ak maths they've done try very well bu lolu bu fa ci xalé nak demon na fi nga xamanteni mom moy ati mota collect fuf non nekk ci gana li mo la wonal né sa daw da dafa janga dafa am knowledge xamna num doon doxale mbirami parce que jamono joju nonu da nga gis ne education nek na lo xamanteni lu jeufela aissatu soko dege suñu mami wala suñu yaay de daan wax ne won jang amna suñu xamne sa amul won opportunity bi pour dem school waye ki nga xamne ni nak mom mo fi nekkon jitti rew di sa dawda mom nak ci ndimbalu wajuram ak ñene nak ñene ko dolel try na level besam pour mu acquire li nga xamne moy knowledge bi nga xamne dekk bi mom la soxla pour mu no yobu dekk ba kanam waye nak sa daw da emul ci ati mota collect rek waye dem na scotland yoka janga jange ne fofu nga xamne mom moy liverpool tamit waye nak ci bir janga ji yep aissatu bu jange ba jexal nek na lenen ak lenen lata moy nek politician waye ba ñoo duga fofu nonu rek dina la baye nga waxtan nak suñu mbokki alpulari ci brief educational background bi nga xamne ni sa daw da kera ba jawara jarna ci
Oke okay, Aida jara mamo ya wanu mewi eri onnon ko sadauda uh, jawara ko on hande men are fi gambe en be be fonu do tude mo onno to joma men uh, adi non men do manna de me yetto on ko honno o rewri jande makko nen educational background makko on am um, uh, o fuddo di non e on school inete do muhammadan ko iwri don go ganye scholarship ko non o yari all boys high school o jangi don ko iwri don ha joni o yahuno gada kadi ka inete ajimuta o beti don gandal makko ngal ko dum don hollata o wakkilare makko ha joni o hattali gana tum o arsi kano fi yahu gol ton ka inete ton scotland o jango e uh, liverpool ko o gaini dum don non o lamike o woni uh, golli e nokke nak ci lolou la do ñingato bum joge nak ñew ne kon na vétérinaire sojen manam di jëflanté ak rabbi di leen fajj da nga gis ligé ligé baykaté wala ñene nak ñeneen sen rabbi sen mbami wala sen fassi ñi jëfandé ko buñ amé problème ding ding ko yobu ci docteur bi nga xamné né mo ngi ci mëna jappalé mom nak ci lolou la do ñingato lolou nak né ko na de ci yëngato ba nga xamné ni mu doon ligé ak nit ñi wéx ñi nga xamné ñom ñofi nekkon di doxal gambe bi manam de rol gambe bi lu nak mu ngi xewon ci 1957 bu ngi don def lolu nonu way nak jawara mu dor nak di am ciofel ci li nga xamne mom moy politics bi ta ci politics bi nak mu ko dore won ci 1959 way bi nak mu ngi joinon parti bu ngi non xamne ci ci protectorate people's party mom nak mu ngi joinon fofu nonu gannaaw lool nak di nga gis ne tamit xeyut ben bes rek juk tok ñu def ko njiti rew fal ko njiti rew wayit jaar na amna jaar jaar yi bari yum jaar laata mo agasi stage bobu nonu aissatu nga waxtan nak suñu mbokki alpulaare sadawda lan nak lan la jange won ci university yoyu ak lan la nekkon laata moy duga ci li nga xamne mom moy politics Uh, awa aida jarama boy ha joni no me wi en no on non uh, duma men on ko jango do modja kono ha joni mi jonnay taw fat samba no wodi ko halata seeda simi arta e mom ni burta wo yewtude ko hombo ni sa dawda jawara fatu waaw ay sa tu lolu amna solo bu baaha baaha ba sun de wax sa dawda kaira ba jawara ñu bari nak di len reey reey mbir ne tay so deege ñu ne independent di gambia sa dawda kaira ba jawara mo tax amna ay jamono yo xamne mom ak ku melni pierre sanjay mo nekkon a politician mom bu maga maga mak ci dekk bi bano nanir don non on sa dawda jawara woni no wakili do wakila ni do gambia ha joni heri meden halande on histoire makko ko honto e honto o jamono ji nak speaker house be excellent am motaxid nak ko beni haar mo duga ci ci biir of the house um kadu yu kuma wa bu ko defé rek ñu balen gen setan lan mo fi xew am ha joni no yirno do no harima dangi arama baro mi tew fi white ñu delu wa rek ci li nga xamni mom moy history sa daw da kay da ba jawara ay satu sa daw da nak bum ci mu ko nekkon nak ak ñi nga xamni mom moy ay ñoñam mom fa nekkon ak ñom ay père sanjay ak ñene nak ñeneen la fa nekkalon white gannaaw bi nga xamna way di nga gis ne nak nek na delwan ci nan nek jité wat gambia bi ba 1994 bi ko fa ki nga xamne mom moy yaaye jamme a ko de ta on ko ke am samba sañan woni ko dogi o yaare to ngi senegal kan ko e lando senegal on am do woni abdou diouf woni ko yewti ha be duma tay rek ñep nga tok en silence li nek na bes bi nga xamne ni tay yaram daw na yax bes parce que zoko xolé daw da jawar wara comme numa ko waxe won rek survive na ku yu bari waye ba ci july li bi buñ ko overthrow yi waye aissatu da nga gis ne 
ekala ko be watta ko ko yari waka hima right a dauda jawara andira do en ne do respecto do dum don o wonno non ko lami e o pati inne te do people's progressive party am lul nak de woni li nga Gambia ne ñun dañu gëm ci li nga xamne nak moy suñu flag mu nekk lo xamne lu daw yaram la waye di ni ñi dañ ñi dem ñi dess waye ñi diko ñaanal yena ko yalla xare aljana yu gëna kawé ta ci kar ko ba karami tayit yena su
statesmen or the world. We will never be forgotten in this country, the African continent, and the world at large. We will achieve a job one day. We Wife, 
Council of the Republic of the Gambia, <coughs> the Chief Justice, Honorable Ministers, Honorable Members of the Bar and the Bench, Members of the Diplomatic Corps and Council of Corps present here today, Venerable religious leaders, the Imam Rajiv of Bangalore and all Imams present here today, and Supreme Standing Council members, Mr. Bishop Oliko, and all the members of the Christian Council present here today. The Deputy Mayor of Bangalore, and the mayor of the Caribbean Municipal Council, district chairman of divisions, chiefs, and alcalde, who are all present here today to witness this historic solemn occasion that is taking place in Gambia's House of Parliament. It is indeed for us as the children of South who brought us up in the political arena to stand here today with pride. As much well as the more this great son of Africa, a great son of Gambia, we as a people, the colonial days, there is nothing more big in terms of cohesion than any department. He sacrificed that because a call was made on him by the government people to come and lead a crusade against colonialism, against tyranny, against suppression. He took it up, although he didn't know what was in front of him, but Gambia was what everything. I want to thank the two four two ladies sitting here, Lady Chile Tower and Lady Jerry Tower. And to extend our condolences to the family of Sadhana Lady Jerry Tower, to the families of the Fosters, the families of the Jais, and the families of the Bojan. This is a collective occasion where all families have some say to say to contribute and be part of this solid occasion because Sahara was for the Gambia and for not one not individual or one tribe or one religion. Sahara was a Gambia. He proved it when the initiators and forefathers of the PPP went to him and said they want to form a party and lead them to lead it and it's called the Protectors People's Party. He advised them strongly that the unity and cohesion of Canada is more important now that us have a party that encompasses every Canada in respect of where you come from, which tribe or which religion. And he proposed a new name for the People's Progressive Party. Thank you, Sir, now, for making Gambia one united front, one united family. The champion the independence of this country and became our first prime minister. Look at this. The first referendum for us to become a republic. We lost the referendum by the start time of the Bush. And the submission, important delegation from Senegal, from Madagascar, welcome to witness this occasion. We thank you very much for leaving Senegal, coming up to here to witness the burial of the greatest shock of Gambia, Sadaleke Rajara, who had a very serious relationship that I know with my guest. Even when before we became a politician, as a very doctor, I believe this is how I'm going to go to my guest. And 
this continues even after he became a politician. We thank you very much, the Senegalese delegation, for coming. And please continue to pray for the friend of Biden's life in the state today. Mr. Speaker, Saturday they realized the importance of Gambia and Senegal. That is why immediately after independence, he sat the same one and they signed the declaration of an agreement on education, culture, youth, and defense. And because of that foresight, we were able to be saved from the desperation and treacheries of terror in 1981 when Kukwe Samasani waged war against the government. And we thank Senegal for their intervention and accepting and respecting the agreement that was initiated by South Africa. This achievement, we know, is to make this openness, this balance of peace took place between Gambia and Senegal. And for the first time, each of the countries set a diplomatic position to the other country. That was great person. But over the And I never had a problem. Some of the people who said to go and negotiate with you two countries until there was peace between them. When they were there and surrendered them for the moment of the had their problems. Some of the people who went and negotiated and make sure there is peace in this country. When the war of Iran and Iraq took place, Saddam was chosen as one of the countries for the mediation of peace. And unfortunately, the chairperson of that mediation team died immediately after that. That was the president of the king, Ahmed Seyed Touré. And the United States, the UN agreed that Saddam should get that team and two thousand years before, peace was established between Iran and Iran. Echo was, you are one of the initiatives. That is why the name Echo was, a manager from South Africa and his then Minister of Finance and Economic Affairs, I am Gal Jehu. <coughs> and his play and his activities. In this community, all Gambians know about it, all Senegalese, and everybody in the sub region knew about Saddam's activity to bring about change and development in the west coast of Africa so that our dependency on foreign aid should stop. We should be able to make sure that it's intentional, they will able to be set. There are countries that have gold and diamond and oil. Instead of governments going there and fighting, they are here with our leaders. Thanks to Saddam. For 29 years of Saddam's rule, not one Gambian child crossed the desert to die or the Mediterranean to die. Because of his foresight, he built a cohesive relationship between his government and other governments based on respect for the independence and sovereignty of each and every state and no interference. And we became a world icon whereby some countries like Norway, Denmark, Sweden, England, no Gambia needs a passport during some other time to go into this country. Thank you, Sarah. He was a great man. He had nothing to think about for the welfare of the Gambian people. How to uplift each and every Gambian from poverty to whatever you think you should be comfortable with and your family. Therefore, Sadawada made to us because of the character of Sadawada, because of the values, the good values that Sadawada has put in us that he does not tolerate terrorism. 
He doesn't tolerate religious discrimination. He doesn't tolerate sexualizing. And we have seen all of us here. These children are here. Sarada has never used his office to promote this family of people who are related. All his children went to the same school that we went to. He all played football together with our one police officer guiding him. He goes to the supermarket with only one police officer and Sarada is going to push him to fall when he was pressed. Therefore, we the government going to ourselves and our children and generation on board to inculcate in them this type of values that Sarada has brought to bear in this country, whereby the whole world sees Gambia as the bastion of peace and stability, democracy and human rights. That is why in 1975, at the OAU conference in Kampala, Sarada proposed that because of the historic dynamics of Africa, being the most dehumanized race of the world, Africa, because of our experience of slavery, our experience of colonialism, should establish a national institutional office for human and people's rights. He was able to convince his colleagues, the heads of state. But when he comes to establish the headquarters, there was no continental chain in Gambia for qualifying to have the headquarters today in Gambia. And up to today, this is Gambia. Thank you, please, Mr. We, as Gambians, have seen that during Saturday's days, agriculture was prospering. We are having Straight farmers for the consumers. Coming to live with our own farmers in the rural areas. And our own farmers feeding them. Because of the assistance in schools and other assistance we give to the farmers, that these farmers from other countries come to live on our own farmers, or farmers who are better. That is why in 1993, we were able to buy over 150,000 tons of nuts. But unfortunately, with the change, I was listening to the Dead Minister of Finance in 2015 that the total tonnage of the Gambia was 35,000 tons, a direct reflection on the poverty and degradation of the farming community. That is why our daughters, our sons are crossing the desert and dying in the ocean. Sarada saw it. That's why we made the facilities so that our children will stay home and be responsible and be proud to be the sons and daughters of their mother. The same thing happened when Sarada became president. He established the post of authority. Come tell. Social Security and Housing Finance Estate and the Campos and so many corporations to allow Gambians to have uplift our economic possibilities and responsibilities. And these institutions are the biggest employees of this country <coughs> up to today. And the boss, of course, I forgot the boss corporation. Therefore, I think we should learn from this wisdom of Satan. For all the things that he has done, I will say, we are going to take to our must call the fire box. I was fortunate that when Satan went to Saudi Arabia to act as an assistant to build a big mosque of Ayu, I was in that delegation. Unfortunately, we have a competent ambassador in the past of Dr. Omar Jack. They met the king, and the king made sure he provided King Fahad Mosque in Bandu, thanks to Sarah Rakhia Bajan. I can go on and on, but I have seen my friend here looking at me. <laughs> Being in the 
cabinet of Sadat has been part of the delegation of the city too that went to negotiate for the independence of Ghana. And like the ICC is sitting here, the first parliament is second to the prime minister. And these are the people whom we as young people brought us up through the very values that Sarah have put in them and make sure it is implemented by the day. We have there Asim Usama, the former vice president, Bakari Dabo, Dabo. And we have my first boss, Oleru Lamin Kijijabu, the longest serving cabinet minister on the South American region. MC Chan is there today. And all these people were people who were beside the Asiti, because Sadat had never had to suppress the Oru imposed. He was a real democratic leader, and his stupidity allowed all of us as young people who can be his son to agree with him and make sure we put our voice across, and he is never angry or he will never show anger to anybody who opposes any opinion that Sarah had. We have Mrs. Farmer Tabajan, Jalo. When Mrs. Farmer Tabajan is here with us, who closed the world and worked very close with Sarah and became a vice president. My colleagues are here, party leaders who have come with respective parties. Sardauda, I can attest, sent me on three occasions to Sri Diva when Sri Diva was a leader of a crucial party. Send me on two occasions to Asamusa Kamara when Asamusa Kamara was a commercial leader. Yes. For them to come and answer to him without something, national issues to discuss with them. All rivers flow to the coast. Being oppression and being government, we are all supposed to work for one destiny and one country, and it does is Gambia. And Gambia's interests come first before anything else. Yes. And that's how that would have played that role and be respected. Why I want us now to continue building that in our younger generation, in the younger generation, that we should stop avoiding people. We should stop making people go. Sarah has never ever done it. Finally, Madam Speaker, I want to thank <coughs> and commend Belichia Jawara. I want to see who goes to Sardar's after every other Sunday since he came from the UK, except the bad part of this country, but I'm very fascinated. And I've seen how dedicated, how committed, how well Lady Chile was to this old man. We thank you, we commend you, and we pray for you, for God to restore you with prayers, and you and the whole family of Sardar the care of our you have made us proud. Why do one say the more of saying for it than for saying more? For now, suppose you are putting your work up, then you are going to work, then you are going to work, then you are going to work. Because I am a living witness to your commitment, your torture, everything. Because taking care of an old sick person is difficult. Thank you, my dear children. I thank you all. And we pray that Sadat will be born when it is going where he is going, that he was in Ghana. And our hopes have been uplifted from what we have heard from people. And God prays for something good that is being done by any person. And Sadat has never done anything bad for this country. We pray for him. You are going. Physically, yes. But spiritually and mentally, you are in us forever and will try to emulate your standards, your values, and your characters and make sure we not only work by it, but we put it in the other generation so that Gambia will be one of the nations to be emulated by all. I thank you all for it.
and PPP demand will be maintained. Of course, there was another crisis possibility that we will not be this now. Crisscrossing the country. Many crisscrossing the country all the people. Naturally, they had to get their own government. So from then on, we had a big fair tremendous challenges. For reasons, some of them are customer, traditional, and the rest of it. But what impresses me about this man who has been here is his humility, his tolerance. I emphasize his tolerance. That is one thing we must learn from this man. Tolerance. <coughs> this man would be as a human and suffer when he fought for the insult. <coughs> but he would never, ever, he had never, ever asked anyone to arrest him or do anything to him. I know all of you.
the establishment of the Ombudsman was another one. You can have a, a long list. You cannot finish the list today because of time constraints. But he was, and one year he was concerned with also was in ensuring, for instance, that ordinary citizens would not become victims of abuse by administrative machinery, by machinery. And that if they do become victims, that we can have an easy, accessible, expeditious way of resolving that. And this led this decision again in the early 90s that an ombudsman of the established for this one to serve uh, the citizens. So that way it made my job as Attorney General very easy one because he was himself the champion of the guys, he was the champion of the judiciary, and he was the champion of the protest. And if as a commissioner you have a head of state who of that kind, it makes sure your your struggle is going to be easy. But his his concern for good governments was however not confined to the domestic sphere of the government only. It became a part and parcel of the government's foreign policy. And that policy saw the government initiating many, many important steps, taking many initiatives, important initiatives uh, within international organizations. The government never hesitated, respecting for which one he was concerned, to speak out publicly if need be against violations of human rights by anyone. And so he, he said that Thomas Keloni in Africa was the one who stood up and condemned the fact that he was being mad and then dictated of his army. And this led to his proposal also for, uh, for the establishment of human rights in the that proposal, proposal was accepted, and all of us in the Commonwealth, uh, all the head of grassroots, his excellency, the president, Sarah, and other. But that unit, since the 1970s, is functioning and serving all the open members, all the citizens uh, of the Commonwealth. He thought also we needed to move further in Africa to establish our own international machine in order to promote and protect human rights across the international. And so in the meeting, in the summit in the Liberia in the 1970s, he was uh, the one who proposed the establishment of one of the commission on human and human rights. Uh, those negotiations which I have privileged to be involved in as a junior law officer at the time uh, were concluded in 1981 with the adoption of the African Charter on Human and Human Rights in Nairobi, Kenya. After two rounds of meetings and after a lot of uh, expense and effort, by his excellency president, uh, Saga made sure to ensure that the effort was not important. And again, in one of the recognition of the important goals that Saga and this one had made in a very important process, the official type name of the charter has come to be known as the Value Charter. It's the Value Charter in the recognition and in honor of the goal that he has. That's been one of his most remarkable goals. And as shown, of course, that our brother Gujia has indicated, the second step was taken of ensuring of giving the economy, the value, the privilege, the honor of hosting the economy, where it has been since its inception. Within the Gambia, also, we have an establishment by South Africa's government of the African Center for Democracy and Human Rights Projects. It has been after it comes to this diversity, and therefore the challenges that arise from that. But Sadar was strong, very active, to work for diverse peoples in the United Nations. He encouraged us to rise beyond tribal, beyond religious, and beyond sectional differences. And I saw this in the many things he did. I saw this in the way he transformed, for instance, the people's project to fact, into a truly national and not a sectional organization. And I saw this also in the way, after every election, after every national election, the way he constituted this country, he paid attention to diversity in terms of gender, in terms of religion, in terms of tribe, in terms of geography. And if you look at every candidate that started with the project started, you will see it really reflected the diversity of the country. It was a conscious effort on this part always to make sure that that very common instrument of government had reflected in the economy itself. I saw this also in his interaction with people. People who interacted with uh, people of all sections, all tribes, all sections, all levels, all courts, all, all, all regions. And I saw this with the trust and the confidence that they had in him. Eventually, each of us comes from a tribe. But eventually, Sadao Zadiri became 
last. Thank you. 